Well, Port Ease is just a unique facility in that, uh, you know, as I said earlier, and I'll tell anyone, you can catch every species of fish from a flounder to a blue marlin within 15 miles of this facility. To lose it would be a shame to all sportsmen. And also, this is where a lot of your shrimp and the whole ecosystem develops in the marsh in this area. And you're talking about 225,000 acres. They found the bug, I want to say it was almost three or four years ago. Uh, then uh, it's just, it's been a progression. And as you, as you look out over this cane, it used to be 20, 30 feet tall, and you couldn't see the water through the cane. And now the cane is so stressed that you can see the, you can see water and you can see the dead cane inside of what's left. And the cane uh, height is, has reduced down to probably six or eight feet. And you're not only gonna lose the largest uh, wildlife management area in the state or in the country, I think, then you're gonna end up losing uh, the shipping and uh, from you know, the quotes I've heard is over $300 million a day that trade on the Mississippi River could have, a, could have a real impact if you lose Southwest Pass. I'm not saying it's gonna happen this year. It, I'm not saying it's gonna happen in two years, but if the cane continues to die at the rate it has been dying, it's gonna be a concern in years to come.